Fresh mountain air. It's a term many of us have heard, maybe even said, but a couple of Edmontonians are now actually cashing in on the concept. Our Desmond Lanka joining us now with more on a, a rather unique venture. <laughs> Daryl, these two men are actually selling, well, literally selling Alberta air. And experts agree Bath has some of the purest air in the world. Air. Freshness to go. Please breathe responsibly. It's not so far fetched. Cover your face. <laughs> your nose and all. Yeah. Inhale. It started with some friends that travel, people that travel and come back from Asia and all over the world and say, you know, we should be so grateful about the air quality that we have every day. It sparked an idea for Troy and Moses, a theory, one they tested, of course. So we scooped up as much mountain air as we could, we put it in the bag, we uh, sealed it, taped it shut, and we posted on eBay for 99 cents. The second bag sold online for $168 US. That was how Vitality Air started, right there, in a bag. But the Ziploc bag wasn't reliable, wasn't really clean, and it wasn't the only way they tried to capture air. We came up with an airbag. We found each of these methods to be pretty inconvenient and uh, expensive for shipping. So we came out with our bodily method, which gives the customers way more than 150 inhalations per, per, per can. Less than a year later, the product is on the market. Pure Bath Alberta air. Never thought I'd ever sell air. Never thought in a million years I'd sell her. My dad, Key, he basically told me, well, you know, I support you, but don't quit your daytime job. Both smoke, still work full time on other careers, but both have lofty goals for their air business. We want to get it into vending machines. We want to get it around the world. We want to have it on shelves in China. Our goal is to try to sell 500 bottles a day. Um, and uh, I think with everybody's help spreading the word, we can do it. The large air bottles retail for $15 plus shipping. The guys with Vitality Air told me just a week and a half ago they were twiddling their thumbs hoping it may catch on. Now, Daryl, they are busier than ever. Okay, do they have a process for bottling this air? Or how do they do this? You just wave it in the air? Yeah, run around with a Ziploc yeah. bag? No, they're past that. Actually, they will share a little bit. They will say the process to, ca to capture a batch of air, which fills about 100 bottles, takes about 10 hours. But that's okay. it. They're not sharing the rest because it's a trade secret. Of course it is. <laughs> you can see more about them and, of course, uh, their product on our site.